Hi, it's Aidan here, Blackpool Auto Mart. I'm showing you around this Renault Capture that we have in stock. It's cost finished off in a lovely red metallic paintwork. It's on a 19 plate, it's done around 24,000 miles. I'll confirm the exact mileage when we get inside the car. It's got a contrasting black roof on it, with black wing mirrors. Also got diamond cut alloys on the car too. Suit the car really nicely. Onto the rear of the vehicle, we do have a reversing camera in this capture, I'm not sure whether you can see it. I'll show you what it looks like on the infotainment system when we get inside the car. Walking around to the driver's side, I'll just show you the last two alloys. This car's for sale at Blackpool Automart, we're part of the Cox Mo Group, privately owned family run group of dealerships. You'll find other Cox Mo Group owned sites across the northwest in areas such as Kendall, Lancaster, Southport, Wigan and of course Blackpool. Our franchise deals include Honda, Seat, MG and Volkswagen. The non-franchise side of things include the Automarts, which includes us. So you've got Blackpool Automart, Southport Automart, Lancaster Automart and Kendall Automart. The Blackpool site, you've got Blackpool Seat on the corner just there. Next door to them, you've got us Blackpool Automart. We sell a variety of brands of cars, as you can see from our website, Auto Trader and on our pitch. Next door to us, you've got the UK's only super bike store, which is Honda Bikes. Over across the road, you've got a flagship dealership, which is Blackpool Honda. And over in the distance over there, you've got the painting body shop clinic, as well as the in-house workshop. So all these cars are to go through body shop prep prior to sale. You also go through a nice and extensive workshop check to make sure if you're mechanical on the car is working as it should be. As part of them checks, your brakes and your tyres are also checked, and the car does also get to the service prior to the sale of the car. So starting off at the rear first. Got a nice spacious boot in the back of this capture. Do you also have a dual level boot? So you've got a false floor which you can lift and slide up, giving you a raised boot floor. And your seats do also fold in a 60 40 split, giving you plenty of extra room. And as you can see with the raised boot floor, the rear almost is almost completely flat, which makes it very pet friendly. You do have some pets. So onto the rear interior. You'll find a full leather interior in this Renault Capture. Some nice patterning down the center of the seats. You've also got your ice fixed mounting points in the rear for any child seats. And you also get plenty of leg room for rear passengers. You'll notice the interior theme is cream and black leather. Looks very smart, works well together. Onto the front of the car. Again, full leather interior. You also have your tan, uh, your cream, accents going along the door cards and across the dashboard. Onto the interior, you've got a five speed manual gearbox, you've got a manual parking brake, a couple of cup holders just hidden down there. You do also have a cruise control and speed limiter button just there too. And you've also got an eco button. Got a nice amount of centre console space. Got a USB port, that's where your SD card for your maps goes. And you've also got a cigarette lighter power outlet just there too. Got a handy little slot to place your key to keep them secure while on the move. And obviously this car is a push button start, which is just there to the right of the key slot. Got climate control buttons just above that and below your infotainment system. Moving on to the infotainment system. Just noticed it's an excellent feature, which I've only just noticed this car has, but you do have park assist. Excellent feature to have. Didn't realize it had it just until I noticed that icon just there. But onto the main menu of the infotainment system, you've got your satellite navigation in the first option. Got all your multimedia sources, that includes your radio sources, which includes Stab Radio. Got all your vehicle and your driving data. Bluetooth hands for your audio. And lastly, you've got settings, system settings in the final option. 
Moving on to the steering wheel and the speedometer. So as you can see, the car sat on 20,758 miles. Got the buttons to control the cruise control and the speed limiter just here. When you select these buttons, just down in the center console that I mentioned earlier. Got voice activated control. It's where you can speed to your entertainment system. Rather than use a touch screen. Your left hand stalk has all your light dials, main beam, full beam, and indicators as normal. And on the right hand side, you've got all your wipe settings. Got a couple of buttons on the end of the right hand stalk. If it focuses, there we go. That controls your trip computer, located just above your digital speedometer. Personal preference, what you have displayed. However, most people tend to display the range. And on the driver's door card, you've got electrical windows for all four windows. You've got electrically adjustable mirrors. One last thing to mention, which I forgot to do. Select reverse. You've got front and rear parking sensors. And you've also got a reversing camera just there too. So that's the car, it's available here at Blackpool Auto Mart. If you'd like to know any more information on this car or any finance options available on this car, please contact the sales team, they'll be more than happy to help. If you do view this car on our website, you can reserve it for £100, subject to viewing. So if you do need to plan your journey to get down here, but you don't want to miss out on the car, that is an option for yourself. If you turn up on the day and the car is in view for whatever reason, that deposit is refundable. We do also offer a nationwide delivery at a flat rate of £199. So if you are quite a distance away from us and you can't view this car in person, you believe this is the car for you that is also an option for yourself hope you enjoyed the video and we'll be up to here for me soon